Hey there YouTube, welcome to the Groovin Piper channel. This is Cody. Uh, tonight, I went to my first pipe meet. Um, they do them at my local tinder box uh, in Reno, Nevada at the last Friday of every month. And you know, the wife and I usually get together on Friday nights. So uh, I've, I've, I've missed all of them until tonight. Uh, finally went tonight and um, was uh, having a look around. If you guys follow me on Instagram, I uh, posted a picture of, uh, you know, some of the Meerschaum pipes that I was looking at down there. And I don't have a Meerschaum yet, but I do now. I <laughs> uh, finally picked one up, and I'm smoking it right now. Um, did some reading about Meerschaum because I know they're delicate. Some some places say they're super delicate, and some just say, you know, smoke the hell out of them, you'll be fine. I'm not quite sure. I, I'm holding this thing I've, like a... I don't know, it doesn't feel comfortable because like, I'm not holding it by the bowl. Um, maybe comment, everybody, somebody, you know, all you guys with a with a, a Meerschaum pipe, is it okay to hold it by the bowl? I mean, I want it to color up nicely, but uh, you know, I don't want to like, I don't want to ruin it, um, but I am holding it by the stem right now. Um, so yeah, this is it. I wasn't too interested in the um, carved faces and stuff like that. Not yet, you know. And like the claws holding the, the bowl. Super cool, but not yet. I just kind of wanted something simple. Um, this is an, I think it's SMS. I'm not sure. But everything was 10% off there tonight. Um, picked up this and a tin of GLP Westminster. Uh, loaded up a bowl of that while I was there. Not in this, just in a pipe I brought. And uh, that stuff's delicious. Wow. I've been missing out. I have a little gurgle going on in here. But um, uh, in it, I have some GLP's uh, Stratford, um, my, my go-to vapor blend. Good stuff. Apparently, you could just smoke whatever the hell you want in this, and uh, you're fine. So, I don't know. You gotta feel it every once in a while, make sure it's not getting too hot. It's warm. Not bad. But I just wanted to come on here and show this off. I know it's not Monday, but now I have something to smoke on Mondays. Woohoo! <laughs> um, yeah. So, uh, any comments on, you know, the best ways to, to take care of this little guy would be much appreciated. Um, that said, I just kind of wanted to, uh, show this off and, uh, maybe I'll drop in a, a picture of the, of, you know, of the shop. You know, I just took like just the case where all the Meerschaum pipes were. Um, there was, uh, you know, 12 to 15 guys in there and it's pretty small, tight space. So, um. I didn't really get a good next time I go because I'm probably gonna try to go next you know next month I'll try to get a little bit more video you guys can check it out in there it's pretty cool pretty cool it smokes great tastes wonderful it doesn't have that um break-in flavor like Briars do. Uh, seems to be, I have a little gurgle starting, just a little gurgle, so I'm, I'm slowing down a little bit. I don't want to slam a pipe cleaner in there quite yet. This feels so weird. Well, it's I feel so dainty holding it like this. You know, I don't know. They say like the first 10 smokes, hold it by the stem. Don't know if, I, or I've already not followed that. I, you know, found myself just, boom, gripping it like I usually do. But we'll, we'll give it a shot, you know? It wasn't the cheapest pipe of all time. Definitely wasn't the most expensive, but uh, I'd like to keep it nice and keep it for as long as I can. Um, that's really about it. 
just wanted to uh, share that little story. Hope everybody's having a great Friday evening. And uh, hope everybody has a great weekend. So keep your pipes clean and loaded. And uh, we'll see you on the next one.